Alright, welcome back to Cypher Campaign. And, you know, an apologies if there's a missing turn. I'm not quite sure what's going on. But I had a video for today. I don't, so. It's a little bit strange. What I will do, though, is continue to drive forces into this gap. And hope that these guys will. Be able to actually do something against this lot. So, that's a relatively strong tank position. Let's hit it with this lot. Well, that was anticlimactic. This is an infantry position, this can hopefully get annihilated in a second. Alright, they helped. Do not want to give up this position. What do we get for a regular attack? Two to one. What if I concentrate all my artillery remaining on this position? Alright, retreat one, but that's not really enough, is it? up, leave artillery. Next to that someone's gonna have a bad day. We have made quite a lot of ground though. on every road. There you go, expecting an ambush which wipes the unit out. Right, the tigers drive up this road. Guys are going, oh, we haven't got enough energy, guys. I'm too tired. Look, I know it's the end of the campaign, we've been fighting this war for a little bit. Calling it a preview at this point is when everyone else has probably finished the game. Feels a little bit over the top. Alright, you can eat all the artillery. Which we need to be meeting this that 10 points. Yeah, let's face it, it's a dangerous place to be. Three to one, I will take that. Ooh, panic, good catch this. Hold the bomb bar up. You know what, I'm going to attack because I think this is better than they think it is. I was wrong. Sorry, lads. That one's on me. Recon in force in this direction. It's all tanks all the way down. We had to tank artillery on this guy. 
This is not doing much. Holding the line, holding the line. In the noble earth itself. That's the Jones and Co's company. Uh, company today. Most of the heavy artillery is going to be landing on this guy. That. I wish they had a few bit more information on the um, this. Oh, that worked better than I expected. They capitulated as well. Okay, we're going to break through here. They are going to be able to hold me. This guy's about to have a bad day. to destroy them but let's bring in a bit more firepower if you don't a good day I'm gonna trust my gut Got apparently in nowhere near Reddington. Impressive, we're still advancing on this wider front at this point. little breakthrough here which is looking less threatening now I would like more information about what I'm facing down here should be able to break those guys Back. Both sides are massively played out around here. Got the event got the advance, but that was costly. Tanks, always more tanks. Where the hell are they? Oh, let's go to all these tanks. That. That's not bad, let's advance into that. And range in these noble workers. So doing much more than that, unfortunately. Yeah. Look this gap. 
try and get around behind them, but again, ambush. Get that road open. You've only got two points, you're not really doing anything now yet. Oh, an ambush blows up three panthers. Ow. Yeah, okay. And then where all our artillery is going. Welcome to the front. Lose a quarter of your force in turn one. Not enough recon. We can destroy this guy. There we go, that's a good number of casualties. Five to one's pretty nice. They capitulated as well. We can enforce. Should be enough for me to arrange some artillery in on it. Even if it's not much. The key bit is produce it so red and has a bat. Four to one. Now one of them held. Boo. And now the guys are moving up are not gonna have enough. What's left to do anything useful? I'm glad I did that. Are there any easy victory points around here? No, there are not. Ah, oh, however, plenty of ambushes. Let's just hit these guys with range. I'm not going to be good enough to actually advance into there any other way. It's holding here. These guys are going to have a slightly poor day. Feels like we're in a holding action as opposed to actually doing anything useful. The ambushes. Here, the next point where I got to lose superiority. I mean, did not hold. Okay, so the rest of this artillery targeting on this guy. Plant a sight, inflict good damage. The actual ground troops themselves are lacking. We do one. That actually worked pretty damn well. That's a math number of capitulations there. We get a second wave in. The guys will have to launch with some steel in them. Oh, 
Oh, they held apparently. Need to move these tanks out here. Pick on this unit force, I expect it to be a tough one. Tougher than I can take them out. They capitulated. It's amazing. Down here, we're going to kill off Anders. Oh, I'm going to try anyway. It's we're going to retreat. You know, for half a poor position, actually. Choice one of them. Really want to move my tanks up this road. Remove you, nice moments. Could be more useful next turn. Moving down the road. Okay. Quite well. And let's cycle this. They're not doing much of interest so far. My family mouse will skip for anything big. Just a few artillery strikes. Attacks that didn't do them much. Another attack that lost them quite a few green GIs. Another one that lost some engineers. They're actually we're holding pretty well down there. But a lot more losses than we're taking. Yeah, this entire front here is doing pretty well. Slight retreat there. 110 can actually have inflicted on the land. Took some losses there, I think that was about 120. But mostly, yeah. We're losing big in a few places, but the general attacks at the front are just kind of bouncing off the fresh units. Or the fortified units. I'm happy with that. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.